everyone, welcome back to Beauty by Violet and today I'm going to do a look using a new collection that just came out from Laura Mercier. It's the Arabesque collection and it's for spring 2013. So we're going to use everything from the collection today. We're going to use the new baked eyeshadow palette and we're going to use all the colors in the palette which you wouldn't think would go together but I'll show you how to do it in this look. And we're also going to use one of their new eye pencils and also a uh, cheek color from the collection, a lip stain, a lipstick, and a lip gloss. And it's all from their new collection. So if you want to see how I did this look, just keep watching. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is just apply an eyeshadow primer. I'm just going to use the Primer Potion from Urban Decay. And apply that from the lash line all the way up to your brows and then also underneath your lower lash line. So I'm going to use the uh, Laura Mercier eye pencil in stone gray and that just came out with the collection. And I'm going to apply that to the upper lash line and don't worry about being messy with this. We're going to pull it outward and just draw kind of a thick line on the upper lash line. Then just pick up a pencil brush and we're just going to smudge that out. Pulling it outward and upward. Just kind of creating that base to start with. And we're also going to put some underneath the lower lash line. And start from the outside and then go about halfway over. And then we're going to do the same thing with that pencil brush. Just smudge that and run it over towards the inner part of the eye. The first color that we're going to start with is called Pink Tutu. And it's this pink one right here. And then just pick up a flat shader brush. And we're going to apply that to the inner part of the eye, just the inner corner. a pencil brush with that color just to get some of in the inner corner and just the inner lower lash line. So working our way over, the next one we're going to use is called Bear Yoga and it's this taupe color right here. And we're just going to pick up a stiff dome shape brush. Uh, this is a 217 from MAC. And we're going to just run that in the crease. And the next color that we're going to use is called Blue Zen, and it's this blue color right here. And then just pick up a flat, stiff shader brush, and we're going to apply that all over the lid. right over that gray, pulling it outward into the outer corner of the eye. The next color we're going to use is this color right here, and this is called Satin Ribbon. And it's kind of an interesting color, it's like a purplish brown. And then pick up your stiff dome shape brush again, and we're going to put that right in the outer part of the crease. Blend that out. Then just pick up your pencil brush and we're going to take that same color right here, um, satin ribbon, and we're going to run it underneath the lower lash line. up this color right here, this blue zen, on the same pencil brush and just apply that to the outer third of the little brush line. Now I'm just 
just gonna pick up a clean uh, flat shader brush and go in with this color right here which is called Soft Cloud. And it's, it looks really blue, but it's actually kind of a frosty color. And then just apply that to the brow bone as a highlight. For a liner, I'm going to use the Black Track Food Line from MAC and then just pick up any cool pencil and dip it in there. And we're going to run that in the lower waterline. Then I'm also going to apply some of that to the upper lash line and I'm just going to use a MAC 266, just an angled liner brush, something really thin. And I'm just going to put kind of a thin line on the top. and I'm going to use the NARS Larger Than Life Volumizing Mascara. Okay, so I did apply a pair of lashes and they're just the Ardell Demi Wispies and I'm just going to put on a foundation primer. And I'm just using the Laura Mercier Oil Free Foundation Primer. For a foundation, I'm just going to use my Chanel foundation. And this one is in Beige Rose. I'm just going to use a foundation stippling brush. Just use a beauty blender and just kind of um, flat it. But I think this color is neutral enough that it would look good on anything, anyways. So over that, I'm gonna apply my powder because then that's going to set that cream product. And I'm just using the Halo from Smashbox. brows and I'm just going to use the um, Tarte Brow Mousse for this and it's just a medium brown. Product. It's one of my favorite highlighters. It's the Cinema Noir um, Shimmer Black. And I'm just going to use a 
dual fiber brush for this and just apply it to the tops of my cheekbones. And it just gives a nice um, shimmer to your cheeks. For the lips, I'm going to use one of their new lip stains. This is in Shy Pink. And um, it's actually a really nice muted pink. And it's almost the same color as my lips. lip stains especially for bridal um, since uh, you want it to last a long time a lip stain under your lipstick is the solution to that. Over the top of that I'm going to use one of their new um, cream smooth lip colors and this is from their new collection too and this is in Arabesque. So just a muted pink. And then over that I'm gonna going to apply a lip glaze and this is bare pink which is from their new collection. I really like the feel and the smell of their lip glosses. These lip glasses are not, they're not sticky at all. They're really movable and they feel really moisturizing. And I just love the smell. I don't even know how to describe it. It's um, kind of like a vanilla, a hint of vanilla and I don't know, cotton candy or something. It smells really good. So that completes the look. We were able to use all of the colors in the new palette. I love how they blend together and they're so shimmery. And um, I will be doing a review of all of these products, and I really did like all of them. So get ready for that. I will be sure to put a list of all the products that I used on my blog and a link to my blog below. And you can also find all these products at a discount on my website, beautybyviolet.com. And thanks for watching, guys. I hope you subscribe.